Today we are testing the Broncos dual valve controller on hydrogen. Um, we supply an inlet pressure of 180 bar to the inlet of the dual valve controller. Uh, this valve controls the dead volume. And we can see the pressure of this dead volume. Normally this would be in a kilobar uh, back pressure regulator. And this is the exhaust valve. The exhaust valve goes to a flow sensor with a rangeability of 0 to 2 milliliters a minute. And everything is controlled by Flowplot. And in Flowplot we made a script that we can run like this. And it will generate a set point to the uh, L-Press. In this case it starts at 37.5 bar. As you can see here, a new set point will be there soon. So this is 75 bar. It becomes stable. Then we go to 112.5, stable here, and to the maximum at this point 150. Now we need to decrease the pressure, so after a few seconds we go back, there we are, you can see the response here. You can see that the valves are actually working by the following the yellow lines. If uh, the yellow line is above 30.8%, uh, the inlet valve is opening, and if it's below, the outlet valve is opening to relieve a little bit of pressure. You can see the stability here within a few seconds. The small corrections you see comes from the adiabatic compression or decompression of the gas uh, that creates some temperature effect which influences the pressure of course so the valve needs to correct it a little bit. And you can see that this 150 bar controller that is actually also capable of doing 200 bar is controlling now at 3 bar gauge, 3.0. And we will do another step just for the fun of it to see if it can control at 1% one and a half bar and we are at one and a half bar you can see it on this manometer anymore so far for this demonstration